bitching you at the crib. But then when, if you as soon as so y'all get in the argument, so she be like, beat, yo, you ain't say that to that nigga. Your, if they beat your ass, <laughs> then what? Mm. Then you just get yeah. your ass beat. But what if y'all told? You still her? can't go home. Raul said no, you already I, told her to go to the car. No, she got to go to the car. You don't want her to see what's going on. <laughs> this shit can go good or this shit can go bad. But if, you, if she in the uh. car, you can tell your own story. As long as you ain't lifting that shit. Wait, hey, check long, this out. Somebody got a camera. They gonna put that shit when on. When they come walking out and you still... <laughs> <laughs> she done seen them come out. Yeah. Them niggas yeah, high five. She, she be like, come in the room, wake you up. Make sure my baby all right. Then, and then you in there, you getting up off of the damn flower arrangements. <laughs> now you gonna get mad at her. Yeah. Why would you have this nigga knocking me out? <laughs> I uh, thought I told you to go to the car. What you doing here? Uh, getting up, you leaking out your nose. <laughs> she trying to tell you to go to the hospital. That's gonna make you even madder. Yeah, but, but about eight of them came out then, though. Got to fight, man. Yeah. How y'all go about breaking up with chick? Breaking up with her? Uh, depends on what type of... You talking about breaking up with a real relationship? Nah, not... I mean... What kind of relationship what you mean, then? Real relationship. What's, what do you mean by that? So we've been in this game. Is for this a couple somebody of years. that I'm saying it's my girl, or you just saying? Oh no, nah, nah. somebody I'm entangled with. Entangled. Uh, <laughs> got you a little slight entanglement. Ghost ride the whip. Ghost <laughs> ride the whip. <laughs> Are you ghost now? What? <laughs> what? Does she know where you live? It don't matter. It don't matter. Ghost, it don't matter. You ain't coming over here. Most of them ain't gonna just pop up like that. Like that's some shit that um y'all in a real relationship. Oh, you must not just seen that but girl see, burn up that nigga car, but in her face, she thought they was in a real relationship. <laughs> yeah, she went all the way for that. I really would love to hear the backstory on that one. Dude told his side. His side. Um, no, what he said. He said um he didn't he 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 lying like a motherfucker, but uh he said he ain't know her like that. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he said he didn't know it like that. <laughs> he said he don't know what happened with that. He said he was just chilling, woke up to the sound of his car on fire. That nigga lied because you know was, she knew he chick. she knew he kept his damn windows down. <laughs> 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 damn, yeah, that man. shit was tragic. That was definitely an entanglement. This bitch almost killed herself. <laughs> <laughs> she was serious about that, the calls. That was stupid. What could he have done to warrant that? Ghost that wasn't no whip. ghost. Ghost riding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nigga, nigga, you won't turn my car, mm-hmm. okay? He might have banged a family member. Damn. He mm. burned my truck up? No, nah, he, he didn't She hit. walked in on him doing something. He hit her auntie. <laughs> her auntie was in the room and she walked in on it. Hit the auntie. Nah, he said, let me flip your income tax check. And what about that Jeep? He ain't paying the back yet. <laughs> You would have bought a Jeep. I'm gonna burn this motherfucker up. She ain't yeah, saying none of that. Nobody money driving this Jeep. She put it. She, he put her whole income tax on a Zuzu. He got that Jeep and that apartment. <laughs> that <was> no <laughs> Zuzu. He got that Jeep and that apartment with her money. I used to have a Zuzu back in college. <laughs> he was, he was that right. shit went fifty five on the highway. He was homeless before he got what? Uh, he got him an apartment and a car. He came up off of yeah. and the new Jays. That sound about right though. No, you know what though? That would piss a woman off because yeah. you was, you want shit when you met her. You used her. Yeah, now you done came up and got you a little little got, got you a little, little stuff ride. together. Ain't even ghosted her. Got you a little ride. Damn. That's fucked up. Anyway, welcome to the Legend Hazard Podcast. I go by the name of Artwork, man. We are back once again. Your boy Bo in the building. It's your boy RH, aka. Raul. I forgot to hit the drive. <laughs> Damn. See Bo in the building. You, what you forget? What you forget? We rock we rolling. Raul. <laughs> What's up, fellas? Ain't nothing happening. Chilling, man. How y'all doing today? <clears throat> cooling, cooling. Well, that's pretty good, man. Y'all know that verses come on tonight. Sick. So you say we got Rick Ross and two chains, right? Yeah, but you know what yeah, I you know what I like boy. about the verses? It always start a conversation about who else you would like to see on Versus. And who would you like to see? Man, I just be coming up with mad random slate. You think about to say Young Dolph. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I want to see Young Dolph and Yo Gotti for real. 
Go That'd ahead. Be a good one. Nah, you, you can't guy. even put them in yeah. the same. Gotti got way too much. Uh, Whoa. He been in the game longer, so he got. Whoa. He more commercial, too. So it's going See, y'all niggas don't know nothing about dog. That'll be more. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. That might be more regional. So they don't know nothing about dog, uh, Raul. They don't know nothing about dog. Got him more think, commercial. I think got his right, resume is a little bit, a little bit better. I want to see uh Maya versus A Marie. What? That ain't gonna last for twenty songs. I just want to see him. I love both of them. <laughs> My is bad. I watched it too. What? Boy. I used to love her. I watched, I watched that versus on mute. Damn, I used to love her. I still remember to this day, A. Marie had that video. She had them little shorts on. She walking, walking down the sidewalk. Yeah. Oh, my God. I don't even remember the song. Um, but I remember them damn so you was listening That song's still hard, by the way. You was watching on mute. Man, I don't know how old I was when that shit came out, but I probably was watching that with the lotion. That was- <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh man, no, that shit! What's I remember. The name of that shit? Oh, Maya had why that. Why don't we? Or why can't we? Yeah, that was her. Why don't biggest, we? Oh, yeah, that's, that, that was her biggest shit. Wasn't I think it? it had a remix too. That was all right. Yeah, but um, y'all remember that video of Maya and Cisco when she had that little like Japanese yeah. or something something on. Nah, you know what? Versus, I wouldn't. I don't want to see it, but I would think it would get a lot of views. What? Mario and um, Omarion. <clears throat> they they have, mentioned that on. You have IG, all I the nineties little girls, and they gonna it's gonna do numbers. Mario and Mario. Mario got some hits. Do he got as many as a Mario, Mario, Mario though? Mario, Mario, Let's see, Mario, Mario don't get into that B2K, gonna get into that B2K stuff. He can get that B2K bag. He can get his solo bag. He can get that B2K stuff. He can get that B2K stuff. Yeah, yeah, hell yeah. You're right. It wouldn't be fair. Now that you said that Bow Wow bag, it wouldn't be fair. Look, I know y'all gonna think I'm crazy. Uh oh. What we got, Raul? I wanna see Bow Wow versus Chris Brown. No, man. No, Chris man. Brown, y'all, oh, oh, man. Yo, knock it off, bro. Y'all, y'all better yeah, start. Y'all know that. y'all disrespect the Bow Wow yeah, now. Knock it off, man. Man. That didn't even make y'all sense. Y'all remember, no, he man. was a Mr. 106 in part now. Yeah, Bow Wow, he's a legend, but uh, Chris Brown. Chris Brown. Come on, man. He can't. The only person you can put up against Bow Wow is just say that because they think Bow Wow corny. That's the only reason why people act like that. Check them stats. I bet you Chris Brown. I bet you Bow Wow done sold more records than Chris Brown has. Nah, mm, I don't, how much you want to bet? I might uh, take that bet. This is Raul right. speaking. You want to talk about this off camera? Nah, Bow Wow sold a lot of records though. Don't get it fucked up. But yeah, we was hey, you know he done been out just as long as Chris. Well, he, he ain't doing it now. Yeah, when he was yeah, young. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Mm. Nah, bro. Not going against Chris Brown. It's not a trip. fair match. I don't think. Y'all tripping? Who would be? I want to see Vanilla Ice versus. Uh, MC Hammer, Hammer. <laughs> <laughs> that shit would get jumped. I know. I still have more than one song. Yeah, he had a um, he had a whole album, didn't he? Yeah, he had an album, but um, only song people remember is that. Dum, 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 Ice Ice dum, Baby dum, shit. Dum, 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 yeah, that's the bone. The only one. You know what? Talking about the white people, we need to see John B versus uh, Robin Thick. Ooh. Mm. They about the same person too. That's a, <laughs> that's a, good, that's a good one. But yeah, that I is was, a good I one. I wouldn't mind seeing that. I like both of them. As far as their career is concerned, they about the same person. But them John B throwbacks though, man. Man, come on, man. Come on. Come on they man. hit different. They do. I still listen to them shits on occasion. For the nostalgia. I like to see it's probably too old for y'all, but I like to see Rock Kim and Big Daddy Kane. That would be. I think Big Daddy Kane said he was down to do that. That would be legendary. I think he was talking to Fat Joe, I think. That would be that legendary. Shit. Don't have to come on early. It's about four o'clock in the afternoon. Start that early in the day, huh? That, the audience for that one gonna be they going to sleep about eight. Nah, it would be at about nine thirty. <laughs> Start that shit at six. So we ain't even elaborate on that two chains Rick Ross thing that's gonna actually happen in tonight. He gotta be Titty Boy. For uh, go ahead. He got to be Titty Boy for eighty five percent of the battle. I'm telling you, for him to have a chance, he got to be Titty Boy for at least 
No, I ain't gonna say 85. 75% of the battle, he gotta be Titty Boy. Man. Rick Ross got some got some hits. <laughs> Flame throwers. That's why I say he got to be Titty Boy. He got some in the bag. Man, I love Titty Boy 2 Chain. He ain't got a damn chance to <laughs> beat Rick Ross. <laughs> It's not mm. a battle, man. It's, it's a, a celebration. celebration. It's called versus. <laughs> when you verse somebody, you're competing against them. Yeah, it's a battle. That's how it started out, though. Yeah, we celebrating. It started no, out like that, but we celebrate. The more they got into it, they seen that <laughs> it was some lopsided ass uh, battles. Battles, and then they changed <laughs> it to a celebration. I think that's what happened. Maybe I don't know. I mean, really, ain't nobody losing in nah, this situation. Nah, gonna be, nah, it's, be dope it's to see. opinion. It's still the same barbershop talking you to talk get about. with who the best MCs. That's just the same thing after at the end of the day. So, yeah, it's all subjective. Like but it's very entertaining I right think, now uh, because I still think you can just do the whole thing the whole wrong way, like Fabulous did. You know what I'm saying? But then you could be <laughs> brilliant when you picking your songs at the same time. So. Fabulous. It's enjoyable. I don't know what Fabulous was on that he, night. He like he ain't know he was about to do a versus. <laughs> you know they trying to talk to the DJ every time. He, he didn't remember. Like, <laughs> <laughs> he going there trying to get his man to he play the right thing. He don't remember his song. Yeah. <laughs> he don't know what's in his catalog. I think Fabulous had just had a child. I think he was probably. No, nah, she was still pregnant. She nah. was there. Oh, I thought she. They had just had a child. She oh, was. She on. was. That's who we, um. That's who Fab kept saying, I'm a grown man. Oh, I mean, when Jada said, I'm a grown man. <laughs> he was talking to her because she was telling him to drink some water. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Jada had the best time of his life that night. It was night. loose. It was definitely Drunk loose. Drunk Jada. So we're going to Rick Ross on that? I know I am. Artwork. Man, I'm going Titty Boy. Uh, Tell me three two chain songs right now. <laughs> <laughs> Why you get mad? Yo? Uh, you can get triggered. Tell me three <laughs> right <laughs> now. You, set off, you got it. triggered, man. Somebody I just hit said the, that. Somebody hit the yeah, button. Think, if it's a battle, then yeah, Rick Ross got the he got them joints. And I like two chain. He ain't going to blow his head off, you though, man. Tell, he he nah, he, 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 he ain't going to be close. He ain't going to blow his head off. It's not, it's not going to... Chain's got some records, too, now. He, he it's not going to be that close. Especially when he get on that soul bag. Chain's rap over them damn and soul like, beats. Shit. I don't care what none of y'all say. Rapper Go to the League was a damn fire-ass album, in my opinion. That intro alone, <laughs> shit was crazy. All right. I think it's going to be dope, though. I'll be ready to see it. I mean, it's gonna hurt. I'm gonna like you play. said that playlist gonna be fire. <laughs> that Aston Martin music or something like that. <sighs> it's, 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 yeah. it's gonna be painful. He's so what just if they have just, to be strategic? What if they just just <laughs> drop the freestyles on? I don't. I don't know. I won't see that. Off the top. I don't. I think that'll be Titty Boy all day. Titty Boy two necklace. <laughs> that wouldn't be fair, would it? What you talking about? Them just rapping? Yeah, just. Oh, no, I don't want to see that either. <laughs> Play y'all records, man. Yeah. Sit down. Because Rick Ross records be too well put together and curated. Very extravagant. Yeah, they going luxury. I want to like see um, orchestras. Rick Ross do that moonwalk. Oh, man, come on now. <laughs> Coldest moonwalk you've seen in a long Ever. time. That shit is so smooth. <laughs> you think he going to have lemon pepper sitting on the floor? With the I, damn uh, Bel Air. Oh, we definitely gonna be Bel Air all over the damn place. He might have some checkers in that motherfucker too. So what are we going into next, fellas? Uh so didn't you say something about what's the level of disrespect towards your female friend that has to be done to make you smack a motherfucker? Didn't you say something like that earlier? Yeah. So yeah. Uh, let's say you out with your lady. Y'all having a good day. Y'all done went to TJ Maxx. <laughs> 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 Dude, what? TJ Maxx. All right. All right I feel you. I feel you. That sound like a good day. Right? Now you all getting some ice. Bargain shopping. Good day of shopping. Good day of shopping, right? 
All right, y'all done went somewhere else now. <laughs> Crazy. Who pull up with the big bags? Now two 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 cats and rolled up on your chick. And just, you know, you Where y'all at? Y'all at, you know, you in the, in the restaurant? Nah, y'all just at uh, Bed Bath & Beyond. Damn, man, niggas is actually up in Bed Bath & Beyond. Come on, man. What they, they doing together out, up in they there? They thud out in there. <laughs> Damn. So them two niggas came in there together, Bed Bath yeah, & Beyond. Yeah, they, they up in there acting crazy, right? What, they talking to your girl trying to get with you? <laughs> no, they ain't even trying to get <laughs> Might just be asking her, like, what oh, man. bread they count they should get. For, they, they in there shopping for their lady, but they feeling good in their day. Right? And then they, they see your chick, she done walked up. And she's like, damn, she got a fat ass all loud with it. <laughs> how, how far you let that go before you just step in and say, hold on, player? They done seen you too. They like seen, seen you. Hand in hand with her and they still. <laughs> no, nah, you ain't hand in hand. Y'all just dad together, y'all looking at sheets. Oh, so this is just blatant disrespect. Just blatant disrespect, they feeling good in their day. So it ain't like no, oh man, I ain't know she was with you. I'm sorry, bro. Ain't none of that. No, they just going on with it. Oh, they still talking about it. They, they get more disrespect from when they see you. So they're gonna be like, your girl got a fat ass. Yeah, it's, just, yeah. it's gonna. Mm. Okay, mm-hmm. I see. And it's two of them, right? It's two of them. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Cause, two, they, Cause they feeling good about this. Uh, okay, yeah. There's two uh, ways you can go about this stuff. Yeah, you gotta be smart. Now, the first way you could be like. Well, thank you, brothers. I know that. <laughs> <laughs> and go on about your business. That's the grown man way. And then the second way is you're going to have to uh, get into a little bit of a tiff with these two brothers. Now, what, what size is these brothers? Are we talking about like... All right. Well, look, let's just take, take a little further. <laughs> we we, we out of bed, bath, and beyond now. All right. We, we out of bed, bath, and beyond. <clears throat> we just anywhere. It just happened to be anywhere. But... These two dudes is showing some energy to your lady that's real disrespectful to you, and they know you with her, no matter where the location is. Damn. Why I got to be two of them, though? All right. You want to take it down to one? Because it's usually two of them. It's usually more than one when yeah, that disrespect goes like that. That's like when it, it get tough. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it ain't when that disrespect goes like that, it's, it's more than likely it's more than one. Because ain't nigga by itself just mind his business more than likely. Yeah, For me man. with they men, they might know they got their thing with them. They got their mans with them. That's why it I can go. Two, I, right? I haven't seen it go like that. That's why I say two. These two ain't gonna let me be tough at all. Yeah, but you gotta yeah. like. Yo, girl, got yo. You gonna have to do something to try to. You gonna either have to like, defuse the situation, <laughs> or you gonna have to get into it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> and at a certain point, you just gonna have to get into it because after, after you try to defuse it and it still goes further, then you just gotta get into it. Yeah, if you wanna go home. Yeah, she gonna look at you different. Than Either you know way, you gonna look at yourself. But, all right, okay. Now, what if your girl is? Nah, you might be all right. <laughs> <laughs> what if you ain't got? You ain't got you that. Might be thankful. You might not have that hype me up girl. You know what I mean? Just be like, hey, babe, let you know, let, let that go. Let's just get on out of here. Your lady, your lady. You she know, might try, try to defuse the situation because she know ain't nothing going, ain't nothing going down between her and them. So she's oh, just trying to like, man. it don't work like that. Nah, but then they still. call you, man. You better get out of here because your bit. Damn, she told him he done uh, called. He done done called her bitch. my girl. He called done, a bitch. He called me a bitch too. He yeah, done called called a bitch. He done Indirectly, he just called me a bitch. He too. slapped on so, the ass. So do you do you oh. do you go ahead and do your handle your business and golly. And take it there, mm. or use grown man and walk out the door. But you got this man just That's, disrespect your whole family. Yeah, he disrespect my grandma, you. my granddad, he you and your and your wife and your girl. Said my great bitch, grandma oh. one shit. Come on, oh man. man, oh let me, bro, you got to fight. Yeah, yeah. Which what you do first? I'm gonna tell you how this yeah. guy go. All right, so these two niggas they acting up. Yeah. You got to get your girl. You got to have her face, and y'all got to be facing towards the door. Like you know what, baby. Go ahead and go to the car. I got this. <laughs> Tell her, go ahead and go to the car. Like, look here, y'all young suckers. <laughs> <laughs> I told y'all I didn't want no problems. And y'all being real disrespectful. You got to swing on one of them niggas and run, man. Like Right there? Yeah. You, you swinging. Right, why are you running? And the one you hit, what you got to hit him as hard as you ever hit yeah, anybody you knock in your ass out. life. But you got to make sure. But you got yeah, you, if you hit him. You got to put fear in the other one hard. That's how hard you got to hit that one you hit. I mean, it depends on how big it is, neither. One of them might be big as hell. You got to hit him first. That's the one you got to hit. Yeah, you got to hit him first. And you got to stun him. Now, you, what if he eat it? 
Damn, and be looking at you happen. like, all right, that's, that's it. when you go yeah. to that running situation <laughs> yeah. I was talking about. If he eat it, I'm gonna have to fight his big tough ass. And God, that nigga gonna like, slam you all over them. I'm gonna be trying. I'm gonna be trying to tell him I'm sorry if he eat it, but I know we're gonna have to fight. So it is a limit as far as the disrespect. It is a limit for as far as disrespect from. It still man, all really, depends. It's, it's not man. a lot of whole. I, like it depends on how my lady acting. Because <laughs> what if they really? So she cool. You disrespect. You just gonna let it slide. Nah, I'm saying if like if if it's really bothering her. And nah, I got to gotta, fight these. You gotta, you there's I got no way to yeah, yeah, around. Gotta, you gotta, it's a certain way you gotta. You gotta it business. depends on. It's, uh, you gotta handle your business, man. Yo, why does that nigga look like he came out of that damn seventies? <laughs> we don't have to cut this shit off, yo. <laughs> who is he? Who you talking about? <laughs> you see a dude with the afro? <laughs> who is that? This is Solomon know, Hill, ain't it? Oh damn, he All looked right. like a whole nother person. But let's say you think you can take these two. You're looking like, oh, shit. Bro, either way, <laughs> bro, you going to have to fight. Bro. You got to. Yeah. You got to. Because like you said, you ain't going to be able to look her. She going to be bitching you at the crib. But then when, if you- As soon as so y'all you, get in the argument, so she going to be like, beat, yo, you ain't say that to that nigga. If they beat your <laughs> ass, then what? Mm. Then you just get Man. your ass beat. But what if y'all told you still her? can't go home. Raul said no, you already told her to go to the car. No, she got to go to the car. You don't want her to see what's going on. <laughs> this shit can go good or this shit can go bad. But if, you, if she in the uh, car, you can tell your own story. As long as you ain't lifting but what that if, Wait, nigga, <laughs> check this out. Somebody got a camera. They gonna put that shit on. They come walking out and you still <laughs> <laughs> she done seen them come out. Yeah. Them niggas yeah, she, high five. She be like, she in the wake you up. Make sure my baby all right. And then you in there, you getting up off of the damn flower arrangements. <laughs> now you going to get mad at her. Yeah. Why would you have <laughs> you just knocking me out? <laughs> I uh, thought I told you to go to the car. What you doing here? Uh, getting up, you leaking out your nose. <laughs> she trying to tell you to go to the hospital. That's going to make you even madder. Yeah. But, but about eight of them came out then, though. got to fight, man. Yeah. You got to gotta, do what you got to fight. Got to fight. Yeah, you probably gonna have to fight them niggas. Then you might have to shoot somebody. Damn. Damn, there you go. Yeah, I mean, that's the problem. Yeah, those, the motherfuckers fuck you up. Then I, yeah, yeah. You gotta shoot somebody. No, man. Yeah. Just catch them another day and light them up. You gotta shoot them. Well, you, gonna you, catch them one, you gonna catch them one at a time yeah, and fight man. them one at a time? Yeah, you better. That's why I told you swing on nah, they them beat, they didn't beat my ass one time. That shit hurt. I don't want them fighting no more. I just got to get my revenge. <laughs> <laughs> my eyes still swole from the last time when they beat me up. Yo, if you with a girl that's constantly getting you in fights, is that a deal breaker? Yeah, yeah that's got to be a deal breaker. Yeah. Because you... <laughs> One fight. You're not an MMA. She man. One, <laughs> one fight when she started. It. <laughs> so she gets you in one fight and you and ain't had nothing to do with it. She started it. You, yeah. Yeah, you out. Yeah, it's over with. It's a done deal. Man, I ain't fucking with it. Yeah, she, she bad. Yeah. Especially now, I'm talking about she now. Bad she bad news. Yeah. Talking right. about she started, though. Now she yeah, started. Like, 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 you just walking into the spot and you just, she arguing. I'm like, talking about yelling at somebody crazy. She, she spitting a nigga face. Yeah, she be like, come here, man. Come on, man. What am I supposed to do with that? You can't even walk up and be like, nah, you know you was wrong for that one. <laughs> you can't say that. You got to go ahead and go with your girl. At that time, yeah, you got to then when it's I don't over, know, man. You got to walk crazy. in and be like, what's going on here? What, <laughs> what's nah, going on here? You, you don't talk to my wife like that. <laughs> she been in there the whole time talking to the nigga greasy. Yeah, talking crazy to her. My man will fuck you up. <laughs> Pussy ass nigga. She got, you were hyped up. Yeah, got you, you hyped up. up. He yeah, come two piece. And Mike Tyson in there. <laughs> yeah, this nigga look like Mike. Yeah. <laughs> Built like a tank. You know what you gotta do? You gotta go in there and snatch her up. Real. But what the fuck wrong with you? Nah, you can't he do go, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On, <laughs> on, on, on out the door. <laughs> look, look, Don't look, just look, stand look. there, y'all. Got to, what the fuck wrong with you? Let's on go. Out the door. <laughs> Your damn wife got the little buzzer thing. They told you y'all table ready. <laughs> go in before you, you walking in there behind her and she, she arguing with somebody. And all I wanted to do was eat my little <laughs> my little food and get some wings back home. Try and get some wings. Yeah, I don't know if I can live with that type of pressure in my life. No, nah, you gotta go. Nah, because you always gonna be on guard. Oh uh, yeah. I'm gonna be in my anxiety every time we go somewhere. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you just can't go get no damn. You gotta tell motherfuckers like, nah, man, my bad. She off a of meds today. She, <laughs> she bipolar, man. She got a mental disorder. 
I don't get about that situation. I ain't refill a prescription. A girl coming home from work and be like, I need you to come me to work tomorrow. This nigga talking. <laughs> I got to need yeah, you, you to fight some nigga at work. You can't deal with that type of energy. <laughs> he think it's a game. You can't, deal, you can't deal with that type of energy. She no. can't work there no more. So you want me to fight a nigga that work with you? Yeah. You, you know this going to be your last day at work, right? <laughs> 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 I don't care. I just want you to fuck him up. Yeah. You got to go into all these questions. You got another job backed up? Where are you starting at tomorrow? <laughs> Questions yeah. start. None of these damn bills ain't gonna stop. That's crazy. I can't deal with that in my life. No, nah, you don't want that type of energy around you. What if your child is like that? If you got a daughter mm. and she like that, she grow up and be like that, and then she be like, "My dad, whoop your ass!" And she just getting in all type of shit because he. Man, you that's your baby. Really you know like that, man. That's my daughter. I'm, 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 I'm probably gonna get my ass kicked. A whole lot, cause I'm probably gonna be whatever she say. Man, <laughs> nah, I'm gonna talk about it. You gonna get, get to a point where that shit is gonna I'm be getting be, old. I'm be about it. That's why I'm baby. That nigga said what? You, did you what? did what to my little girl? Ooh, nigga, yeah. you know what? You gonna fight about two times, and then third time she gonna ask you that. Now, now why? You gonna be like, now why you keep getting in these situations? It's <laughs> starting to figure out yeah. it ain't them. It sound like Especially it's you. If you get rocked on one of them. <laughs> no, nah, you can't get rock around your child. Hell no. Nah. I mean, now you ain't got no daughter no more. It can happen. Nah, can you imagine? Y'all niggas act like y'all can win every fight y'all yeah, fight. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> but that's why <laughs> niggas don't want to fight. Though. We don't want to be out there all crazy. Like, don't volunteer me to be some shit. Your hype you up, daddy, 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 daddy. And you go in there, hey, motherfucker. Bop. Yeah, you walk around the corner, six of them, you smart enough to be like, hey, fellas, how y'all doing? <laughs> you know, that's my daughter right here. Um, she, she a little bit wild at the mouth at times. She didn't mean nothing by it. But Nigga be like, I don't give a fuck about that pussy. <laughs> what? Run your pockets. And what you going to do? He's going to run my pocket. God damn. <laughs> oh, shit, now I'm getting robbed. I'm getting robbed. Hey, I'm getting beat up. Oh, hell no. That'd be last time. Yeah, then you really got to talk. Like, about look, it now you need to, you need to, uh, you got, shit, that, uh, you got that shit from your mama. You need to tighten up on your mouth now. <laughs> By the time you stop messing with uh your 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 girl and your damn kid that got you fighting about it, you gonna be nice as hell with them hands. Uh, maybe. What's up, man? What's popping, man? Y'all about, niggas man, ain't got no energy. Bro, we need a theme song. Hey, I know we, a chick that sings. We still on the Legend Has a Podcast. She can be like the Elvis. Good. <laughs> Elvis is trash. Elvis. <laughs> <laughs> What's been happening to you guys? <laughs> that's you know, trash. Be like the smart uh, guy that be like, just the Elvis. Uh, 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 wait, the hey, smart guy? That's how they theme song sounds. <laughs> I don't it's think the LB. <laughs> nah, that's we ain't gonna go with it. Nah, we ain't gonna That ain't the way. Nah. Nah. Oh, well, we put like a trap beat gonna... behind it. That shit might be fire. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> They be like, go, go. <laughs> nah, we ain't doing that. <laughs> Who's next? L B L V. That ain't uh, it. We're nah, not doing that. That ain't right, it, bro. Then. That ain't the move. I'm just throwing some shit out that there. It, that's not it. So what we getting into, I think guys? the theme song should change with every episode based on what we're talking about anyway. So we're going to have one different every time. That's a, some extra work. That's a lot of shit. <laughs> yeah, that's like, how you going to do? You got to record a new one every episode. Yeah, you, man. You going you to be... Uh, I, got, I got 16 for y'all every, every week. I got 16 for you. Mm-hmm. It might not be the hardest 16, but it's 16. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? I mean, we might have to... Listen to a little yeah, bit of that I, I, footage. You know what I'm saying? I don't do it for free, though. Oh, okay. You got to pay me. <laughs> <laughs> expensive <laughs> words come out of my mouth. Feel me. I feel you, player. Damn, that's thunder. Yes. <clears throat> it's coming on around here. We ain't got no surge protect these little. Uh, no. Nah. That ain't <laughs> yeah. Nah. You ain't gonna cut it right there. <clears throat> dun, dun. Stop looking at TV. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Man, what you about to what you yeah. Well, about? You, yeah, you, you said you were like ready to fight. I don't know. Nah. You don't know which way to go. Oh, where are we going with this, man? You was talking about niggas that think they tra- they like trash. Oh yeah. 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 Oh, okay. That's what you was talking about. Yeah. <clears throat> Complaining about their life, right? Yeah. You think people 
or you or people you interact with do that like complain not look at their life and be like god damn man what the fuck am i doing for me, for me to be honest sometimes i'd be like this wasn't part of the plan but at the same time i'd be like damn it could be a whole lot worse than this absolutely that's a good on way to look at it <laughs> Just looking at the positive. Yeah, I be trying not to say that it ain't what it is, but I be like, damn, I know for a fact it could be a whole lot worse than this. Like, this ain't even on the side of, if it's a two-sided good and bad, this ain't even on the bad side where I'm at, so I ain't even seeing that yet, and it could be way worse than what I can imagine. Yeah, but saying that... You know, it could be a whole lot better too, right? Don't yeah. You feel like that? Yeah. Yeah. That's but I'm, I'm so do you knock yourself I'm trying out to, because I'm trying to do that now. I I can knock myself for not trying to do it in the past or before. But shit. That's water under the bridge. Now I'm, I'm, I'm getting, getting at the, it. I think that's the big key though. When you see that you can progress, you know, make a move to make yourself better, to do more, you know. I feel like that's because everybody. I don't think everybody in the spot they they want to be in. But if it's that uh that motivation in you to nah. to to do more. Okay, I guess what I'm saying is so that makes sense. To make but do you hold better. yourself? Do people? Do you think people hold themselves accountable? They they get motivated for a minute, right? In a moment, they might watch this video. Read a book be and get all hyped, hyped, be hyped up. But overall, as far as I can see, people most people don't hold themselves to a standard every fucking day, day in and day out, and no. myself included. Yeah, I feel a lot of people. And a lot of people don't like, even recognize that it is what it is, <clears throat> and they just rolling with the punches. You know what though? People that hold themselves accountable ain't the ones complaining. That's a good fucking <clears throat> point. That's a good if you point. already know. What you doing and you ain't doing or you could be doing is better. What you you're not the one complaining. The ones that don't hold themselves accountable are the ones complaining. Exactly because we are. The, okay, so this is what I believe. I think where I'm at right now is based on a, a culmination of decisions I've made in the past. Right? Exactly. Yeah, y'all yeah. believe that? Yeah. yeah. So it's nobody to really complain to or. I understand people venting, but it's really nobody to really complain to or you to keep complaining about something when it's your fault. Yeah, keep, kick mm-hmm. yourself in the ass and keep yeah. it moving. It's like I'm at this job because I've made these decisions. I'm mm-hmm. here in my life right now because I've made these decisions. And I'm the, really the only one that can fucking change it. But I don't know if I, what I, I guess what I'm asking is I don't think a lot of people think like that, man. I don't even think they think about that shit. Because, you know, we go... You might go to work and you's always somebody complaining about the fucking job. And of course we all do, but it's somebody always just like complaining about what they do right now. Yeah, it's like, yeah. God damn, man, what are you doing to get out of this motherfucker then? If you're gonna complain every time I see your ass. That's why mm-hmm. I can't you cannot come up and complain to me if you have not made no effort to change your situation. Don't say shit to me if you ain't tried to change your situation. You ain't went to school. You ain't applied to no another job. Nothing. You ain't went and go learned another skill and you complaining about your shit. And you just, what the fuck you think gonna happen? Somebody just come out of nowhere and just give you an opportunity? No, it don't work like that. So don't, don't complain to me because I don't want to hear it. I went there. But once I'm, again, there's a lot of people that do that, right? Oh, yeah. That's absolutely. when you tell them, I don't want to hear that shit. <laughs> I can see if you was trying. I mean, it's like, y'all, uh, I tried this, you know what I'm saying? But they just said they ain't need me, whatever. Like, but you know I think what? the biggest thing with it is a lot of people are afraid to fail. A lot of people are afraid to step out their comfort zone. I don't even think it's that. I think a lot of motherfuckers just lazy, dog. That, I that's, think that's they, what they, it is. They, they, they go do what they do, and they like, all right, I did my time for the day. That was enough. I'm about to go sit on my ass. So it's time for me to go do it again. Yeah, I, I see that. I also think a lot of people don't believe in themselves and they don't know what the fuck it is that they're Wanted meant to do. to do or want to do. 
That's a big yeah. part of it. Right? Yeah. I think I see that a lot because... Because regardless of how you feel, you can only get so far by yourself, even if it's something that you think you a master of. It's going to have to be some collaboration somewhere from somebody to get some type of push to do something to turn you in the right direction. Something you only going to get so far by yourself, I think. Man, I think people really need to just, if you ain't happy with your situation, you really need to comp- you need to be educating yourself on either something you want to do or it's learning a new skill or something because people might take this mindset like they only know how all right so they they might have grew up in a time where CDs was a thing everybody was selling CD blank like selling the burnt CDs everybody right right yeah. they might come to this this time right now with that same mindset. They haven't learned that times have changed. You know what I'm saying? So you can go out to the streets right now with them burnt CDs. You're not going to have no success with that. So they're not adapting. Yeah, yeah, saying. exactly. That's, what I, that's exactly what I'm trying to say. You have to adapt with the time. You have to learn new skills. And just because you know something was working at one point, and like when you got that job, it was good, and you won't complain in then. But now that job is not sufficient for you, right? And yeah, a, that things a, change. It's right. like the pandemic right now. That, you that, that's where it's a up. lot of adapting going right. on. You got to switch up and fuck you doing, right? Yeah, you Even need us, to adapt. We was talking about off mic and off camera. What we need to do as yeah. far as the business because because you can see a lot of shit from, change. Like a lot of corporations, for example, Disney, the Disney Corporation, the park been closed for a long time, but on the low, Disney getting ready to take over the streaming service industry. They already got ESPN Plus, they got Hulu, and they got the Disney Plus. And they're getting ready to, they gonna have their own streaming service offering coming up real soon. I think they're trying to take over. I don't know yeah. if they will. I think so. I don't know if they will, but <clears throat> they they're adapting. They're gonna yeah. get a yeah, they exactly. are adapting. They're if they don't take huge. over, they're gonna get a nice spot. In in the rankings, they definitely gonna be huge with it, just off their name. With the movie theaters closed, now they yeah. bring in a preview. I mean, brand new movies to your streaming service. Gotta, they're the ones that stand on top. Is the ones that's adapting. Yeah, like certain places stop producing one thing and started making masks. Yeah, when the last Do time you, y'all been a blockbuster? I'm saying though, do you think it's easier <laughs> for some? Do you think it's just as easy for, um, because we talking corporate levels, right? They yeah. adapting. They got a lot of resources and money. So you think it's just as easy for somebody who's not on that level on the lower tier to adapt as easy as they do? So let's say, yo, you going to your job tomorrow and you didn't have the foresight. You going to your job tomorrow and they say, oh, okay, we adapting. We don't need you. Mm. And see, the way I'm looking at stuff, I'm looking at stuff totally different now with the pandemic and all of that. And I really think it's almost essential to have more more than one stream of income. Exactly. A lot of people... I mean, that's all the rage nowadays, right? A lot of people say that. It's, that's the talking point. More than one point... Um, one source of income. Yeah, as many as possible. Many yeah. as possible. But I guess what I'm trying to ask is that that's not as easy for I don't know. Is that easy for everybody? Because not, motherfuckers uh, on the internet make it seem like it's easy. It's and everybody not easy. ain't no, it's definitely not easy. It's everybody not easy. isn't because nowadays we're making it seem like everybody is built to be an entrepreneur, right? Yeah, or you know what I'm saying some people just ain't made for that and there's nothing wrong with that but But, we talk but the the whole the norm now is to talk like everybody is bossing up and everybody's a boss so what is the the it it ain't even gotta be on that level I say for instance you go to your job right you go on your job you working a full time whatever 40 hours a week but on your time off and on your weekends or whatever, you going to cut grass. That's another stream of income. Okay, yeah. yeah. That's exactly. You know what I'm saying? You, you, you might gotta, go and watch cars. Something, so yeah. something. You got to yeah. be like Baby D. You got to uh, sell something. dope, do hair, and um, babysit kids out the same house. 
<clears throat> yeah. But I mean, that's, Until you come up. That's that's. I mean, it don't have to be. I get <laughs> off work and then I'm going to start me a whole nother business or something. Like that. You could be doing a side hustle on the side and just be some. You just got to find what it is that yeah. you. Yeah, especially with the are good at. Yeah, yeah, especially with the pandemic. And Proficient in. And the second, and it shouldn't feel like work to you. Something you yeah. love to do. Yeah, that's another talking point that everybody say. But is that? That's not always easy though. Nah, to find shit. something that you. Love to do and can make money off that. Yeah, that you gotta, support you. Yeah, and Man. I agree with that. That's that's more realistic. I think like it's not even if you love something or prof- are proficient in it, like that shit gonna sell. Are like, you gonna sell um your fucking uh sweaters you like to knit? Um, yeah, you can't sell with so many of them. Just I'm family. just throwing some shit out there. You gonna sell like sometimes the hobby can't be. Well, yeah, be that. I don't. I don't think in every sense. Right. Yeah, I feel you. But you got to think about it. People are real crafty, though. They'll come yeah, up with ways. Yeah, I think to if you're creative enough, you can. Yeah, you can find a niche. You might get your check every time, every week or two weeks from your job, and go gamble with it. That might be your side of. And it also that depends be, on right. how what what you're trying to achieve on the outside, anyway. Some might not take as much as others. So whatever success means to you. Right? Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Bless you. Bless you. That, makes, that makes a lot of sense, too. Yeah. Because that success is... Uh, That's subjective. It's relative, yeah. Mm-hmm. Subjective to the person. But I'm saying, all right, then. Let me ask y'all a question, then. What mm-hmm. what, what do y'all think would be successful relative to, to y'all? Successful for me is being able to... One, I want to be financially free. Um, you know what I'm saying like and that don't mean like stupid crazy money of course I want as much as I can get but <laughs> just yeah. where you but but you good you ain't worried about nothing just, yeah well, well I'm just good I wake yeah. up and do it you know Whatever you what want. I want to do and make the money how I want to make it and not depend on and one emergency ain't gonna ruin your yeah, life yeah exactly yeah exactly that's that's successful bro. yeah that, to that, me that's yeah, I feel you. Yeah, that's good. Somebody else's version of success might be totally different than that. Somebody might like working at the fucking factory. Like I really, honestly, truly, I can't want see to it, be able to wake up and. Do, there's people that really fucking like that shit. They might. I, I want to wake up and be able to do what the fuck I want to do every day. Me too. When I get ready, how I get ready. That's that's success to well, me. When you say do what you want to do, that's financial freedom. Yeah, that could yeah. be totally different between two different people. Yeah, yeah. But you might want to get up and go on your yacht and go on a trip to a whole other country. That's nah. I think he's saying like wake up and I ain't got. The, I ain't know nobody. About, about, I ain't worried about nothing. No, no monetary. Level. I ain't know nobody. Like, and that can be different. My, it's my I schedule, mean, but <laughs> that could be very different because we can wake up now and not be worried about. Monetary stuff right now. No, I can't. <laughs> no, I'm talking about like <laughs> nothing. You good. You good all the way around. You can go here and blow this one, amount and good. You free to move. One, how you I ain't do. gotta have free to move how you want to. I don't have to have a, I don't have to have an alarm clock. Is just one. like niggas work overtime and, and you ain't gotta worry about none of that. You ain't yeah. gotta worry about going to nobody's job. You I don't. I don't want to have to turn on an alarm. That's different Ever. though. That's because you don't have an alarm. You still want to get up. I still want to get up and do work. Yeah, I still want. I want to do the work that I want to do. Yeah, if you are doing, you working for yourself. Shit, you probably working more than you did at the job where you just had to go work like nine to five. Like like we can wake up and shoot this fucking podcast. All right, so. If I want to get enough mailbox money where I ain't got to do nothing else, how about that? You talking about more of a passive income? Yeah, where it's taking care of everything. Well, that mean well. That's I think that's the goal for most folks. Yeah, I mean, I don't. Well, you know what? I don't know that because I don't think a lot of people want that. Much. Think about passive income, uh, but look, related, what I'm to, related is, to like we, me with my passive income, I ain't gotta be a millionaire to be happy, dog. That's what I'm saying. I'm saying though. For real, setting I, up a passive income is is not that easy though. That's true, but I ain't got to have. I mean, you know, Buku millions, but most people is greedy though. When it comes to that, 
Yeah, you right. Greed take it all. You know where that comes from? I think on this level where it's like people not living within. They, they, Cause the more you get, the more, the more people tend to want, right? So yeah, they're not true. living really within their means. So even the shit we saying could be null and void once we get some money and we'd be like, fuck. That money I thought I wanted, I want more. You see what I'm saying? I think a lot of people fall into that trap. Like where it's like I mean, once you start getting in different circles, you were around different people, then you notice that all of a sudden I oh I got to this level of money yeah. now. Now you like, oh shit. Now they doing like, some stuff. Yeah. You oh, wanna be able I, to do that. I gotta level up again so yeah, I can be. But doing you really this don't already. have to. If you think I mean, you about don't. it, you could be like, shit, I'ma stay right here and I'm I'm good. I mean you don't have a lot to of do people it. don't think like that. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. They fall That's into why that I trap. Think that Keeping people up really with the need to be, they need to be happy with they self. They really do need to be happy with themselves because find your lane and you stay just, in it. Yeah, you can have your stuff that you said you wanted when you was a teenager, and you finally get it, and then you be cool with that. You got you a decent sized little house, and and you could. You yeah, know what I'm saying? As long as I can maintain it, because <laughs> you, you know what? Go out and do whatever you want after that. Like yo, bro. I'm gonna- I'm straight then. Shoot this podcast. I'm gonna go do, after <laughs> that. We are gonna go do this. I ain't got to be able to go on vacation every month, but you know, it's nice to go like take me about once a year. Yeah. It ain't like three a year, yeah. you know. It ain't got to be nothing special either. You no, know, just want to no, just to get away. Yeah, look, just go to couple, Atlanta. A couple of road trips here and there. Just yeah. get away for yeah. a little a couple days. You ain't got to get on the plane every time. Just want to go to Atlanta. That's just like I seen. Um, <laughs> Mike Vick was talking about. Yeah, and before he's staying he, in Atlanta. Before he got locked up, his wife was complaining about spending. She went from spending, well, being able to spend 45 to 50 a month, it went down to 25. The fuck was she spending $50,000 <laughs> on? Nah, yeah. that was just the budget that was set. She had to. It, she, she had, had it. The, they the, had money like that, bro. Freedom, That's what I'm saying. If you get to a certain to level, you go on. Forty-five to fifty. <laughs> motherfuckers start. But that forty-five to fifty went down to twenty-five, and it was kind of. And that's where it gets up. fucked up because you forget how to even like live like that because you already accumulated so much shit. Yeah, yeah. That bro. you got to continue to pay for. You don't want to give up now. That's crazy. You know and what? I think we're just saying there. it because it's a stupid amount of money to spend per month. Fifty thousand dollars a month is fucking crazy, <laughs> but you ain't never been on that level. That's what I'm saying. That's how that I shit can get out of hand, I, and bro. Probably, what type of shit are you buying? Well, it's, probably with not, not, it's, it's probably not a lot of money either. If you really it's think not. about it's it, it's probably right. a couple suits. I mean, if they ain't bills you, and stuff, and they think about it. No, if I really yeah. do think about it, it's still a whole lot of money to me. Nah, but you got this multi-million dollar year. Got this multi-million dollar estate that you living in. Well, Ain't no yeah. telling when what you kind think of about like the house and all that. And yeah. Fee, you got yeah, the, yeah. you got the cleaning crew to cook Boy, that because you created you created those. That's bills. what I'm saying. You created those. You not living. Yeah, you living driving a three four hundred thousand dollar car. Yeah, you living that life, but you living inside your means at the time. Yeah, but uh, you still maybe not because like, you think it's more is gonna come. You like shit. I got this. I can go in and blow this. Uh, That's why niggas go broke right there. <laughs> Let's see, blow this advance because I'm gonna keep getting it. You know what I'm saying? My next one gonna be the real one, and then you fuck around, get hurt, or you go to jail or some shit like that. And now, now you messed up. I'm at the, the age now though where I'd be real comfortable not being seen at all. Yeah, you just might. That. I don't know about that. You, yeah, for real, bro. I mean, you just you might see me here and there, but you, you ain't gonna see me. <laughs> You not I'm not everywhere like I would have been before. And you don't know how to find me. I I got my own little duck off spot somewhere and I'm just good. Yeah, I'm with you. And on then that, it's bro. something like I don't know what it could be, but it's something I got. I'm like, but damn, we're gonna go go to this. We ain't did nothing. Pop out. I think all of us are like that to then a certain extent. I'm gone again. Like I ain't got the I'm telling you, I ain't got the You ain't got to be bopping downtown all the time. No. Mm-mm. I feel you on that. I could be good, dog. I, I, I but like, that don't mean you ain't spending money. I can entertain myself. That's something totally. I think that's different. Just because he, you know, you don't want to be seen on me, you ain't fucking up money. You can still be fucking up money sitting in the crib. Damn right. Find some shit to buy. Fuck on Amazon, buying shit every day. <laughs> we'll say Amazon. Yeah, <laughs> 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 buying shit every day that they don't need just because it's there. 
I had money. I'd be, be there fucking my, I'd be be there fucking my money up on like real estate. And I'd just be on 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 the real on realtor.com just buying up shit. Not knowing if it's a good investment or yeah, not. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Got it though. It's mine. It's mine. And we bike. Like we never left. Check, 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 check. Ew. Ew. We in the game. Ew. Mike done turned the damn TV off so we can stop looking at it. There you go. Uh, now we about to pop for real. Yeah, now yeah, what's up? That's what John it's John it's turn that shit off because it's uh, uh suck. lightning outside. <laughs> Corey got the shoulders. Yeah, he got suck. that sauce on him now. Suck. <laughs> suck. Yeah. Deucey Deuce in effect. Yeah, let's get it. <clears throat> Where we going with it? I got some energy now. We need to go ahead and that's retake we... this whole shit. Oh, damn. Nah. Oh. <laughs> 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 So we're talking about yeah, now. with that. We keep rolling. And you just yeah, shit. We can roll for keep a few rolling. hours. Just just like, hey, we're gonna do it like this. So we're going. So to. the man code, man code segment of the of the pod. We I think it's a call back to one of these episodes we done did. So y'all ever been around? Y'all with some um, you in a group, your homeboys, some ladies in the mix. You ever been around that when you had this one homeboy, quote unquote, that was out of pocket around the ladies? Yeah. So how do y'all deal with that? Just throw the whole vibe off. <laughs> yeah, he's just like, like damn, fucking the whole shit up. Yeah, I think we all had. That yeah. Fun. They trying to chill. They trying to do too much. Try to nah, the lady's trying to chill. He doing too. That's much. what I'm saying. He trying yeah. to do too much. Trying to be too cool. He could be extra horny <laughs> for, <laughs> for no reason. Around a female. Yeah, like ooh, making everything mad, uncomfortable. I ain't seen a woman all day. Nah, I don't came here like with you. you. Ain't never seen a woman in your life. <laughs> what they be doing? <laughs> act like they just got. Man, like, act like they just got out. Yeah, well, they like, got shit. like you could be a chick. Man, what's the fucking Yo, spider? Fuck spider. <laughs> that shit. So really? Where? Yeah, I can't even kill that. Where? Like, y'all are gonna have to handle that. Where? Where? I'm mean, right there. Man, are you? And we got it on camera. I mean, really though, I'm trying to figure out that little, that little little. Nah, we just noticed it though. That's all. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's, I don't, it's, no I don't even see the motherfucker. That motherfucker in his bottle. You ain't got no count to put on it. Don't get me. I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> you in the damn bottle, man. I don't want my spider senses to kick yeah. in. Put a cap on that bitch. I ain't got no. So with I the- I just fucked my whole mode so up. I don't even know what I was talking about. You talking about that corny friend. Damn, man. These niggas be mad horny out here like- Man, horny or corny? Corny and horny. <laughs> both. Chorny. When you being mad and horny, that shit make you corny too. <laughs> Like, it take you to you a out here chilling number? with with it ain't even got women. It ain't even got to be women that you messing with like that. It's just women in general. It's just a vibe. Yeah, mad yeah. inappropriate comments. You mad touchy feely, making this shit creepy. Chicks don't. They all uncomfortable now. They want to go because you acting fucking weird. Yes. Like nigga, chill out. All you gotta do is relax. You know what I'm saying? Go beat your shit before you come over here, man. With all the extra horny <laughs> shit you got going on. Oh, they giving off that energy. Nah, man. Just being like, <laughs> man. You know what? Well, I didn't be on that type of vibe. Then you come what here with all the extra shit. I'm trying to get like some all right, all right, so say for instance, me, we, it could be us four. Right. We could invite four women over here. We ain't right. doing nothing but playing Monopoly. Okay. Ain't none of us That's messing with none of them. It's just, nah, we ain't messing with them. It's they just, just the they fact just, that we just know them. They just it's cool. It's a better environment. Right, when we just cool women with them. We just I playing Monopoly. Everybody chilling. We on. We ain't. Talk, we ain't, ain't. Ain't on that type of time. I feel you. Okay, but oh, you got this weird nigga coming over here. Oh, he in there. better than walked in. Y'all don't want to play no shit poker. What's up? Y'all want to play oh. Monopoly? <laughs> man, what are you talking? Man, go sit your ass <laughs> down somewhere, man. Man, I man that shit corny and that, that nigga mad horny. And he corny. I don't like shit like that. Go yeah, make I the think... chicks be like, yo, we, we about to be out. Yeah, so they, they just ready to go now. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah you you, 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 you in, all, in all games, you have, you know, that that friend that come in like that. <laughs> Nigga be like, what's your name? You talk oh, to I him. do hugs. Yeah. Trying to hug. <laughs> <laughs> 
I do hugs. Man, get <laughs> out of here, man. Go home. Uh, uh, I don't want to hang with that nigga uh, anyway. Uh, yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> but it ain't going to take but one, you know what I'm saying? It ain't going to take but one time and you know... And, and you, you know, like, and you gonna nah, talk to them inviting, same girls again? We're not inviting Buddy, <clears throat> and they gonna be like, "Is what you <laughs> such a session <laughs> coming?" They gonna be like, "Is the whole boy coming?" <laughs> yeah, 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 such a session yeah, gonna pull up. It's like, yeah. I ain't coming then. <laughs> it's weird. So you nigga. know what I'm saying? This nigga, he gotta read the room. We can kick know. it, but y'all can't bring such and such with y'all. What was Buddy's name from last time? Yeah, golly, like damn. What about the nigga that makes like just get extra funny? When the chicks come out, you're extra funny, you're cracking oh, jokes, you're trying to crack on you extra hard. <laughs> no, that <laughs> shit. <laughs> to, yo, that shit right there ain't cool. Neither. You done cracked on you and said something real personal that ain't nobody supposed to know, but yeah. y'all. Yeah. That's corny too. Yeah. When you do that and you putting your own homeboys down trying to impress some, some women that you don't, you even, don't might even not even see them again. Yeah, you don't even really no, know them yeah, like that. That ain't really. cool either. Check this out. What about the, the dude that's so thug he can't turn the thug off while he talking to the girls? And he, he actually scaring them. Like, yo. <laughs> <laughs> hey baby, what's up? You know what I'm saying? And, and yeah, grabbing on him, and, and, and yeah, chicks all yeah, work for corporate, yeah, corporate, corporate yeah, jobs. They, and he, he talking crazy to him. Yeah, he he all on him, <laughs> telling him all kind of crazy shit. He done shot such and such and all of this and shit. They might fuck with that. They uh, might like that. Yeah, they right. might not let they him be might. known yeah, right then, right. but they might pull Buddy to the side. Yeah, they yeah. might scare. He might scare some of them too. At the same <laughs> time, maybe. Like, yo, I can't believe you hanging out with him. But what's his number? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. That's crazy. All I'm saying is, it's man code for you to basically read the room and just know your place, man. Like, yo, just fall in line. You ain't got to be extra, man. Sometimes it's cool to shut the fuck up. Yeah. Just be who you are. You know what? That might be another issue too, though. Don't be the nigga that just shell up when chicks get around either. Just be who you are. <laughs> don't. That's true. That's don't true. Don't be the nigga that won't say shit when the women come. I around. think if you just I be yourself, be but that that'll work sometimes too, Raul. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Right, for real. Why though? That, that'll I work. That'll work sometime too. Oh, he too but good. No, to talk no, to no, it depends. Cause you can come off two different ways when you do that. You can come off creepy. You can come off like mad. You can be too all good. Oh, for he's us. solid, but he like he something. Oh, he he's cool with it. But yeah. you could be oh, what the fuck is up with this mute ass <laughs> yeah. nigga over here yeah. in the corner, <laughs> acting like he's scared to talk. Go both ways. Yeah, he can be stalkish then. You just oh, stand it's creepy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she just stand at the chick and just looking at her. I ain't saying that to you. She's scared of him. He done undressed her with his eyes. <laughs> Serial killer. <laughs> Damn, he look good. That's what he said to himself. Well, I mean, but how did that good. shit work out, though? Did, did, did the not saying shit work out for you like that? It go both, like you said. Yeah, it go it, both it's ways. a possibility. That they 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 need to find out more about him. Cause yeah. He ain't said shit. All I mean, that's day. who I am anyway. But like you said, it can be too much where you just yeah, I think just so. some yeah. on some whole. You in a whole like room. you in a whole yeah. other planet. Yeah, yeah. You, just, you just real weird at this yeah. point. He ain't even in the room with us. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It could be some whole other shit. Yeah, you just weird to us right now. What's your What's the first thing y'all look at when y'all um meet a woman? First thing you look at on her body. On her body? Do she got like, uh, do, far, do clothes, she get, whatever it is. I look, look at the shoes. Ooh, do she got, about to get into something right now now. Look, hold on. Do I she look got at her shoes. We about to get into something right here, ain't we? No do, matter what she got on, I look at her shoes if first. She, if she got sandals on, I'm looking to see what them toes look like. Now you gotta look at up. them toes. Now. Hold on now. <laughs> if the toes fucked up, we, ain't we got nothing else. to talk about. Right, but what if it's wintertime? What if she's a ballerina? Damn. It's snowing outside. You know what? to you? Is she walking to you? You know what? I feel like in the winter time, I feel like if if I was still single, it could be a waste of my time. If I find out them feet, I done wasted time talking to your ass. Damn, what does she look? You ain't gonna holler at nobody because it's cold outside. We record. You still record? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You ain't even on the mic. <laughs> but- <laughs> Yeah, we gotta get better, for the bro. last 20 minutes. We gotta get better. But you, better. all right, this if it's winter time, you're looking, you're looking at the whole the whole shebang if it's winter time. 
Like if it's coming to you, this nigga said he ain't going. I'm looking at context clues. What if she like, fine as fuck, but her feet fucked up? You not fucking with her, but you ain't gonna see that no. in the wintertime. No, you ain't gonna see that she, in the wintertime. She Aaron Rodgers. That's the only. Feet that's the only up. flaw she got. Not gonna fuck her feet. With. She yeah. can keep her socks on, fam. That's the only no, flaw man, she got. I don't know. It's her feet. That's the only. I don't know. Like man. you ain't like never. It. Like you ain't never had a better time with another human being on this planet than you had when you were her. But her feet fucked up. Feet and fucked you up. Gonna be like, like you know what? I can't even. Can't even rock with you, shorty. So, so I'm talking about like, so she walking around. She got that big, thick ass, crusty heel. Whatever you think of, <laughs> you, can get that, you can get that heel fixed. Yeah, that's bro. what I'm saying. You, you can, you can say that thing down. Be like, let's go get our, let's go get our feet done. <laughs> You you, you oh, gonna get no, on this bro. getting your feet done regimen and it's gonna make it what's fucked up at you? least like soul and nails you. black. You know what? She can't have polish on. No, I'm talking about no her her actual toe is black. Not no polish. It's just, just normally <laughs> just, just a normal that normal black toenail. Huh? So you ain't talking about the toenail. You mean like the toe? The nail. No, like the, the nail. inside the nail part. That shit is like black. You done seen it been motherfuckers with their feet. They shit black. It's not. Come on, that shit like black. Like it's about to fall off. Yeah, like yeah. it's one of them injured yeah, ones. Yeah. It's like something happened. I can't do that. You know why though? Because in my brain, I don't know why, but in my brain, I equate like unkept, ugly feet to uncleanliness in my mind. And it's like it's, why? It, I don't know. It's just like if your gonna, shit, if you don't keep them up, I can I, I figure like your pussy pussy money it got stank. <laughs> oh god. I ain't gonna say that. I, your your she, pussy got stank. It got to. It got if, to. What if she's like a gold medal hundred meter? Yeah, yeah. Runner. She a ballerina. You know they got fucked up feet. I mean, I'm cool. Like <laughs> So you good on that, huh? Yeah, so you what just if she's like a barefoot uh soccer player. <laughs> This dude said a barefoot oh, soccer oh, 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 what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god! I mean, what she uh, she wear, she she playing like in indoor sports on with the bare feet, bare nah, feet on the gravel. I mean, I feel like that's kind of that's kind of dirty. But anyway, why are you just barefooting everything all the time? That's a little nasty. Man, she just might be free. So the best time you ever had with a human being on the planet Earth, you gonna let that go? Because of feet, because of feet, feet jacked up. Oh, because we had a good time, so now we got those memories. <laughs> but we got to work on those feet. Yeah, you need to pray to God that them feet can get fixed. Okay, so what if um, like I said, I look at it like. The feet, right? <laughs> Not the feet. Hold up. Now, you just shoes. said the same thing I said, shoes. pretty much. No, oh, I you mean, mean like, so if she got some some, yeah. some clean shoes on? Yeah, I want to. I like, yeah, for like. What do they like, like clean, clean. Uh, like Skechers? You see, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with Skechers? I'm asking you. Like, <laughs> so what if she had on some clean Skechers? No. Nah. <laughs> what you mean, nah? <laughs> I didn't say nah. I'm just like I'm thinking Skechers. Yeah, I hope they still toes. <laughs> yeah, she might just got out work. I hope they still toes. <laughs> oh, she got the clean. What an outfit look like? I'm talking about like she got the, the little cool little fashion over fit on, but she got the Skechers on. Oh, but she got a fanny. But she like, got a fanny though. You ain't gonna tell me you ain't gonna talk to her because she got the Skechers on. Because I already know in your mind. I can't. You'll be like, man, I can get her. I can get her some better shoes. Yeah. Man, I, I can get her. I, 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 I can fix. I can fix this. <laughs> yeah, you can fix. It. That's an easy fix, though. Yeah, it is. Not. It's, it's a, not an easy, easy fix, fix. Yeah, all the time. Is. Yeah, it is. It is. Not all you the time. can buy some more shoes. Yeah, you can, but she might be like, you know, you trying to tell me you gonna get her the dumb shit? Is she going back to the sketches? <laughs> yeah, she might just have like a. Uh, <laughs> The sketch is gonna she get She might missing. not believe in paying over a certain amount. The sketch, the sketch is gonna get missing though. She ain't gonna have no choice but to put these yeah, shoes that does She might not believe in paying a certain amount. So she's gonna just go to Roses every time she's trying to get her shoes. Yeah, she's gonna rock like some mom. Um, Damn. I still get her some Nikes for the low. She ain't yeah. got to. She might rock some Air Monarchs. Yeah, she, I can but get her some for the low. Seen a, you ever seen a woman in Air Monarchs? That's disgusting. <laughs> That is Damn. fucking shit. <laughs> she a head football coach for a <laughs> uh, little league team. Oh, that means she probably got a size 15, too. Mm, 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 Damn, mm. But I believe that um, 
Yeah, them, them shoes, that can be an easy fix, though. It could be, but she, what if she don't believe in spending a lot of money for shoes? Or right, she that's why want, you buying them, though. But, yeah, she might tell you no. Like, she she going to put on the damn... All that shit's the same to her. They so miss. They missing. Like the sketch the is missing. She getting, like, the little $2 uh, thong flip-flop shit side of Old Navy. I, I can't stand the fucking flip-flop. Every, every color. I hate them. Every color when she they had that sale, no, that, that, fact, that day when they had that sale, she got the all white ones, but they <laughs> dirty. <laughs> she oh, ain't white yeah. no more. Yeah. So y'all, well, hold on, hold on. Yeah. They dingy. Yeah. So y'all don't like women in flip flops? No, I can't stand. I can't, 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 is that what I'm hearing? Can't I'm not saying I don't like the woman, but can't the definitely do the white ones. Trash. Definitely can't do the white ones if they dirty. Yeah, now I understand. That's that. disgusting. Yeah, I do understand the white. You flip-flops. knew you shouldn't have came out the house with the gray flip flops. I think every time you wear them, they need to be fresh. I mean, <clears> brand new. <throat> so you talking about like they got to be like some some forces? <laughs> so you can wear the forces till they get dirty. You got to toss them out. Yeah, if you ain't gonna yeah. clean. And they the two dollars shit too. So it ain't like you can't just like get five pairs. And I'm gonna right? and I'm gonna say something. Y'all say y'all hate women in flip flops. I, I didn't say it's that. cool if they just live in the nail salon. Let me see them pretty feet no, that you just got done. I just hate it them. is not. Nah, the they can't put no shoes. Yeah. Yeah. They can't put no shoes just on. Flapping. And then Mine I hate was, that noise. They, they can't put no shoes on. Yeah. 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 I hate that, that noise. Like, flop, 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 flop. They just left the nail salon. Now you get to see the feet that you want to see because you know you not like that though. This man flat footed dog. Like put some heel up under that. You know what I'm saying? But you ain't that ain't you ain't gonna get that all the time. You definitely ain't getting that all the time, bro. Man, look. It ain't even got to be no heels. Just don't wear them fucking thong flip flops around me. That's all I'm saying. Oh boy, so you don't want no <laughs> flip flops. Can't have no busted feet. Yeah, you got feet problem. That's not a problem. I think that's a. This this should be what he pretty likes. standard. Yeah, like yo, go <laughs> keep your shit. <laughs> keep your shit up. You know what I'm saying? And that's it. So a shit got to have a pedicure, or it just got to look nice. Hold on now. Mm. You really don't want that. I mean, what you mean? She got to have so a you talking about like that, that, the that, same thing? That heel? Nah, she looks fit. They can look nice without a pedicure, right? She just got natural, pretty feet. Nah, yeah. them shit's got to be done. Nah, they need painted, man. Yeah, they, they got to be, be painted. painted. Yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Damn y'all, y'all can't be out here with the butt naked. That, that's year round. Y'all, hell, I don't give a fuck about no feet. I don't want to see your that, feet. That's year round. I don't give a fuck if they well, feet. Hold on now. If it's your lady, you talking about your lady now. Now you talking about your lady year round. I'm talking about my current lady year round. Yeah, man. Yeah, I don't care. I don't. I ain't. Need, I ain't, I ain't looking at yeah, I ain't like that, that damn. I want to see your fucking face. Damn, the middle of the dead of the winter, and you you ain't gonna have your toes out anyway. Mean, you ain't got they, to go get y'all them live in the painted. same house. You see them shits all the time. Yeah, they Put ain't. Some motherfucking yeah, socks they on. ain't got to be painted every damn day. Not every day, but I mean, you don't need to go the whole one. Every day, that shit, they, they don't need to go the whole one. Like week, that. something like that. No, I'm talking about this. this what I'm saying, it ain't. Nah, don't don't. Yo, how did we get nah. on this? Because you got a foot. <laughs> this nigga has foot fetish. I don't even know what he <laughs> nah, I'm just saying, it's the first thing y'all notice when you meet. Like, oh, you know, you, you said the feet. shoes. I said shoes. You said uh, f- pretty feet. I don't know. Nigga. I mean, you, she, how you notice her feet when she got shoes on? That's what I'm saying. I feel like that's a disservice to me. So that means that I done had to talk to you all through this winter time until we get to a spot where you done took your sock off. You done fell in love. And now you, you ain't leaving. You ain't got but three toes. <laughs> now I got this. All my time been wasted. Now I feel like I have a disservice uh, done to me. Uh, so she can't have three toes? She got to have all her... <laughs> <laughs> she got to have all her shit. <laughs> You know what? I think this. I mean, I think that I can get. I can. I can go for that. What if it was three pretty toes? Uh, I mean, I'm, I need all them shits, man. Like, why you not doing nothing with a toe? Because I got vertigo. He might just because y'all need to sprint me away. And, me and her both can't be topsy turvy out this you motherfucker. Not Somebody look at balance. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? She can't be over here. I could just push a little bit. She all on the floor. But where he might do something with them toes. What she got though? like a um. Peg leg, like an amputee, like a oh, God. prosthetic. Oh, no. oh, see. Man. Oh, I ain't touching that. I'm yeah, not talking ain't. about this. Y'all niggas ain't ready to take this shit. I'm not talking about that. Oh, fuck. Hell no. 
You talking to a so chick with a so with a no, unibrow? You know something else about that? No, okay. A unibrow? Yeah. You, you know what, that. man? Look, let's get fixable. into some shit. That's yeah, this chick, though. look, I don't know who ain't gonna like me after this or whatever. If she got a unibrow. If she got hair up on her arms, she got hairy legs. If she got the hair that come up to her navel, what about side? You might well count me out. Side, bro. yeah. What's the what's your uh, that shit better be baby what's hair? What's your extreme <laughs> length on the sideburn? No, cool where where, where you stopping them at? I'm cool on them sideburns, too. I'm That's cool, all fixable. You got them little chin hairs coming out. <laughs> That's I'm fixable, cool. man. Is she? You got no, that, she little, that little shadow across your lip. She ain't going to pull up for the week. I ain't mad at her if she, like, keeping that shit maintained. She ain't pull up for the week. If she letting that shit, like... No, I'm talking about, you just got the... I'm talking about chick got more hair on her legs than I got. <clears throat> and she don't give a fuck? She just, like... like no, nah, she just letting it all hang out, like... She don't She do not do none of that. I mean, that's... I'm laying up in the bed, her legs <laughs> touching yours. <and> it <laughs> she talking about her hair on her arm look like your shit. Nah, 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 I ain't doing nah, that. Nah, nah. I ain't doing that either. I feel you. Nah. <laughs> I mean, but it's all the same shit. It's all aesthetics. It don't really mean nothing. It's just a preference. It's all a preference. Nah, it is a preference. But, um... Yeah. But if you got hair on your pussy like that, it probably stinks. So I'm like... <laughs> <laughs> Uppercut. <laughs> I was just saying, like, Boom. I probably should cut that down. I was just saying. So you ain't vibing with you don't like, you don't no. like, you don't like it, Harry? You don't like no. Uh, no. Right. no. You don't like it, Harry? No, sir. I don't mind, ladies, if you don't shave. Yeah, go ahead and put that yeah, shit see. on this nigga. Long as, <laughs> so look, you, you, long as it ain't crazy. <laughs> like, you trim it up. You talking about a bush? Or you, nah, you I don't want the bush. You cool with a landing strip? Landing strip is I mean, cool. That's not even that's like cool. that's different. That's not even a little I bit of hair. It ain't even gotta be like. I'm it. talking about them chicks. You that talking had about the shit with the hair going down the inside? They thought oh, nah. like, oh, <laughs> all that. Mm-hmm. You talking about? Man, I mean, I'm talking about they don't cut nothing. They just baby, let it grow. Baby monkeys. Oh, yeah, nah, that's not. Cool. Yeah. They just let the shit grow out. That's not cool. Okay. No, nah. I mean, like, it's just natural. That's a little disrespect. Yeah, I don't. A little musk on it. You know what I'm saying? That shit give us this um yeah. texture, a little uh, well, I guess. character. But if you say so, yeah. I've never experienced it. Character. No character needed. It's gonna give you a little flavor. That's what it's gonna give you. Flavor. <laughs> <laughs> that shit gonna be tasting like something. That don't mean they ain't clean though. <laughs> does Y'all, it? What? I don't think it does. It just might be a little bit more to maintain. Yeah. Well, they're not maintaining it, so it's just nothing to maintain. It's just like let it go. Yeah. No, I'm talking about as far as the cleanliness, not the look of it. So they putting the pantene down there on the inside of their thighs. They could, I mean, they could have like some uh, mm. the JJ shampoo. Shit smell like piss. They pissing <laughs> all on that hair down there. Mm. Mm. Come on, bro. <laughs> I mean, it's the truth. It's mad pissing that hair down there. You know that, right? You know, if somebody watched this, it's gonna be a lot of hairy women that's gonna have a you lot of shit to say about you. I taste don't, the I don't piss. give a fuck, huh? You done ate some box and you done had that. You had that pissy. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you <laughs> you pissy have. on your lip. Yeah, you, 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 <laughs> you have. Oh, you know she done went to the bathroom. Oh, and came back and got on that. Have you not? <laughs> I'm yeah, <laughs> exactly. I don't know about all that. Yeah, you done had that tang. I don't know about all that. Y'all niggas. Where, where, where do we go with this? I don't happen? know, man. Can we, we, happen happen here? Can we reel this back to a safe spot? I don't know where, how we got here. Where has happened? Oh, man. I harken back to, um because, yeah, we went too far. <laughs> did we? Uh, uh, yeah, we, we did. I'm trying to give a little bit of edge, man. Oh, Randy has a podcast. Randy gave it plenty of edge. He just told these bitches they push this thing. If uh, <laughs> I mean, what it do? All right, you know what? I don't know. What I, I, I know, had, he said that. I'm I've trying never, to cut him, give him some bell. You know, yeah. I've never had that type of vaginal uh, landscape, so I wouldn't know. But in my mind, 
I would think that it would hold a little bit of that pissy smell. Hold a little stench. Yeah, but I don't know. Maybe not. No, man. They if um, any hair and pussy um, chicks out there, y'all let us know in the comment down there. <laughs> let's have that. Don't. <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> oh, I was just saying, like, let's take it to this. Let's, let's do it. All the hair and pussy girls out there, let us know. <laughs> oh, man. This guy. Yo, right. If y'all hear that noise in the background, that's rain. It's raining yeah, outside. We're in the middle of a, a tornado, storm. hurricane, tropical storm. Isosceles. Yeah. That I can't pronounce <laughs> the name of. Start the eye. But we still out here grinding. Trying to get y'all the best content we can. <laughs> <laughs> Just stinking asses. <laughs> <laughs> We ain't gonna make it. Oh, yeah, <laughs> no. We ain't gonna make it. We not. Yeah, we are. We want to thank all y'all that was in here until we got canceled. <laughs> oh yeah, for sure, for sure. Everybody we that watched. Thank yeah. Everybody that watched till we got canceled. We everybody stayed, that watched. And we stay consistent. <laughs> and continue to watch this shit. We appreciate y'all. I mean, y'all Damn, y'all see me working at the gas station, Holland. <laughs> <laughs> for sure. <laughs> hey, look, promo code LV at the gas station. I keep some on your gas. <laughs> we stay in some premium for the unleaded price. <laughs> oh, oh, we'll clean you one. Oh my god, man. Y'all are crazy as hell. Oh boy. Oh man. <laughs> so Hey for sure, for sure though. Thank y'all for tuning in. <laughs> Yeah, all five of you. It. Yeah, all five. We love y'all. You know <laughs> <laughs> we appreciate y'all. Tell a friend and tell a yeah, friend. Yeah, tell your grandma. <laughs> <laughs> your grandma, not, <laughs> she might not want to watch this shit. Oh, um, man. Your young auntie might want to watch it. Yeah, though. she might want to watch it. Your young know. auntie might want to watch it. Yeah. It's free, bad. Appreciate y'all, man. <laughs> I know all five of y'all. Y'all good people. And with that, man, this has been another episode of the Legend Has It Podcast. I go by the name of Artwork. Bo in the building. It's your boy, R-H, a.k.a. Rao. Right. C-Bo is signing out. Till the next time. <laughs>